I'm gonna share my Dollar Tree haul. So I got these labels. These are new. I've never seen these before. And I just like them. I like the border of these stickers right here. So I wonder if they're like all the same sheet, but yeah, we got that. I got two packs of these dot right on removable index um, tabs because, where did I put it? There it is. I've been using them in my ring planner to like put add-ins or little tip-ins in. So yeah, I got a couple more packs of those. And then the last thing I got, so I didn't get too much were these pins. I actually really enjoy these pins and I know I've gotten a pack like this before and I accidentally grabbed blue ink, but I'm pretty excited. I really wanted it for the yellow one because it's my favorite color. But yeah, these are really good pins. If you haven't tried these, definitely try these from your local Dollar Tree, inexpensive. And they write really well. So um, right below, I just got two things. So first I got this sticker book. The Forest Fairies and the Fungi sticker collection. And I was really shocked when I saw this because I was like, this is such a cute sticker book. And I didn't see any other like it. So I think there was only like one left or I just didn't see the other ones, but I'm glad somebody changed their mind because I'm really happy that I saw this sticker book because like one of the cutest sticker books i'm so excited to use it like the fairies and then the mushrooms Anyways, so next thing I got is this ring binder. They had two different options. I did record a clip. Um, the other one was like a, I don't know. I can't remember, but I got the strawberry one. So this is what it comes with. It was 425. So I mainly got this um, because I really been wanting a clear cover and this was less than five dollars and um, you get the clear ring binder and then you get this divider plus two sheets of stickers which I could always reuse these like take out the stickers to reuse them in, my, in here um, for other stickers and then you just get a hundred sheets of lined paper which is decent paper um i won't use this paper but i have my ring binder right here that i just i just want to put all this in here just to see just to like slim it down a little bit i don't know i just really wanted to try it out and it was pretty inexpensive so yeah but I'm pretty excited with um, what I got. I didn't get them. 
Wait, baby. Yes, baby, there's a frog. Come on, let's go in there. Come on, baby. 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 What, baby? You are so sweet, Baba. <gasps> hmm? You're heavy, yeah, I know. <laughs> so I'm here to end off the video, this journal vlog, um, by like, showing you a final flip through because i really love this um and i actually enjoy like writing in it and i grab it a lot to you know write stuff down and, and i love flipping through it it's like really fun just flipping through it so the pen i love using is this one from dollar tree it comes in a five pack i just picked the yellow one because it's my favorite color um and then I just have this big crystal ballpoint pen. So the sticker is from Walmart. It came in a four pack. It came with like three other different stickers, but I just love this sticker so much. I attached it to a tab, hole punched it, and just cut little slits in it to take it in and out and I can move it. But I just like love this sticker so much. So that just stays up front. And then I just have this I don't know what this is from, but this is a flower that was from outside that my daughter picked me and I just like taped it on the piece of this. I don't really know what this is or where I got it from, but yeah, I really love that insert. I just, I just love the flower. And then I just have this one side laminated, like kind of like dashboard in here. Um, and then these monthly and weeklies and all these tabs here was all from this planner. So I know I got this at the beginning of the video and I switched out just because, I mean, I love this. This is just slimmer and I can, it's just easier to um, put in my bag and stuff and it doesn't take up as much space. But the good thing about rings is I can go back and forth whenever I want. It's pretty easy to take my inserts in and out and put them in here. I know the rings are bigger in here too, so if I want more inserts, I can go in here. But for right now, this works fine and I really love it. 
I love the clear cover. I can I love that I can see everything. Um so yeah. Let me continue with this. I'm rambling. So there's my monthly section. I just have some tabs. So there was a name um to the lady that owned this. I didn't I don't know. I just felt weird showing it, I guess. So I just covered it up with some little tabs. I really like how it looks. And then I have this little cut out from a book. Um, I thrifted that book. I forgot what it was called. But this is a picture from that book. And on the back it says, they say the truth will set you free, but what they, ne what they neglect to mention is what happens when the truth isn't what you want to hear. And then, oops, I have these monthly calendar inserts. So I have September and October so far, and that's all I really need. Um, just some magazine cutouts. This is from, oh my goodness, why can I think? My Chai Designs on Instagram. And here's my weekly section. This is also um, a book cutout as well. Sometimes the quiet ones are yelling on the inside. And I just really love that. And then I just have these like little monthly type pages that came with um, this planner. They originally like start with 19. That's how you know how old these are. But see, I haven't even started it. But I plan to do like a memory, a memory a day or something like that here. And just haven't started it. I don't know why, but I can always go back in my dailies and write it, you know. So I have that, and then I have my weeklies that came with that planner. And I haven't even dated it yet, but I plan to use this for gratitude. I need to get on it actually. So a few pages in there, a little to do sheet. And then I have my brain dump. She's actually the 13th, but I'm gonna just mark it off already. And then I just have a few pages in here. I'm not in here that often, um, but when I do need it, I have some pages here. So just my brain dump. I've already kind of like decorated some of the pages. And then I have this little zipper pouch that has washi tape. And then this is my commonplace area. I just have some like tabs. In here. This is what the, I have this like little index type. Um, well, it was like a bank cash insert. As you can see, <laughs> it kind of says it. Um, bank cash insert. And I just white out all the words and just wrote over it. And here's the some commonplace area. I really like how this looks. I mainly wanted this area because I have so many screenshots on my phone of like quotes, songs, poems, um, words, and stuff on my Pinterest as well. So I wanted it all to be in one place and I wanted to look back on it and I thought common placing would be a really cool way to do that. And so I got these dots from Walmart and then it only comes with four colors so I use this star for poems. But I still need to catch up on some of this because I still have a bunch of screenshots in my pictures and on Pinterest that I want to go back and you know write out. magazine cut out and then just an extra sheet of that blank page and then I have this little dashboard that I used um, it's a cutting mat from Dollar Tree that I cut up and used and made it my dashboard and I just have some post-its and some more tabs and then my daily section or my journaling section 
I have um, this little printable, or not printable, this little printout, or this picture is from Pinterest. I just printed it out from free prints. Um, and then this is another cutout um, from that book. And more inserts from this planner. I used the same hack that I did for this sticker up here with this little like printout because I really love this printout. And then here are my like dailies. I have September all in here. I recently started writing more and doing more journaling in here. Here's today, I haven't even wrote anything yet, but I plan to do that here in a bit. Um, but I just have some pages here, my dailies, and then this little sticker release sheet with stickers. And then these two sticker sheets came with this clear ring binder because I got it from Five Below. And so I have those back here, and then I have this pouch with stickers journal prints, pictures, you know, all that. And then I used a mailing envelope and made a pocket and put this in here. And then on the back, I also made it a pocket. So that's just sits back here. In the back, I just have this little printout. I think I screenshot this from Instagram and I printed it out on three prints. And then I have this picture of me and my older brother um, who passed away. So I just love having a picture of, you know, you don't really see his face, but I know that's him. And I just, I don't know, I love this picture. I love how it looks. Um, it's when we're younger and I just think it looks cute. So, yeah, I love that. So that's pretty much that, my final flip through. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.